What's up YouTube and welcome back to Scorcher's Lounge where today we're going to be doing an unboxing. Got my handy dandy Brian knife you know. Alright let's see what this is. Oh wait this is not an unboxing. So for y'all who don't know back in the day uh, Jordan 17 came in a suitcase. And on that suitcase came with a brown box like this. And you can see the label right there. So let's go into this old shoe. See what we're working with. All right. I want to be careful with this. Let me put this knife away because we're not cutting nothing. I just wanted to trick y'all. All right. Let me open this nice and slow. I'm so delicate, right? Bro, you don't understand. Alright. Let's get to the label. Label reads, Air Jordan 17, black, metallic silver, size 11, my size, style code 302-720, color code is 041. And retail was 200 bucks. $200. All right. Now let's take a look at the case. All right. It's an all black case with a little bit of metallic silver on the trim. You got your Jordan, your Jordan logo right here. What's in the bottom? bottom we got nothing got your little made in china sticker is that china yeah made in china sticker right there in gold <laughs> um yeah that's it i don't see no no codes no stamps i don't see anything out here so got your black handle now let's get to the shoe I had this shoe, I had this shoe, my brothers actually, both of them, they were like fucking twins, they both had this shoe, and I always wanted it, always wanted it, I was late to the party, I finally got it, I, I dicked them up, obviously, you know what I mean, and then I re-brought them again from StockX, right here, this is the receipt, I re-brought them again for my collection, for 280 bucks plus the fees 293 let me cover this order number boom does that have my address okay I'll post a picture up there but here goes the receipt the inspiration of this shoe is his love for jazz his love for jazz music that's where the inspiration came from. So you see in the box, it got a CD-ROM right here. This is old school, guys. I'm telling you. Look at all this packaging for stuff that came out so long ago. Now they throw shit in the box. It got the CD-ROM right here. What else? So this phone right here was meant to represent a sound studio. When you go to like, you know, a sound studio, you got these foam things here. That's the whole purpose of the shoe. Like, you know, you have you have your suitcase with the instrument. You see what I'm saying? You see you see where the jazz coming in this whole shoe? See what I'm saying? Know your knowledge. Comes with your regular tissue paper that turned brown through the age. Oh, I don't want to put it on top of this box because not a lot of people have the case and this brown box. This box right here, not a lot of people have it. They'll have the shoe, DS. They have it brand new. Okay. Because I really would like to put the case here to showcase. You know what? I am going to put the case to showcase the case. Like that. Alright, let me lock it up real quick. You know what? I don't even know if the CD-ROM works, but I'm going to put it in the computer 
I don't even remember what's on there. I'm gonna put it in the computer. I'm gonna see what comes out of it, and if anything comes out of it, I'll throw it in this video real quickly. But uh, you know what? Let me put the case here and the box here. Ah, uh, you know what? Come on, you can hold it. All right, let's go. Let's go into the review of the Air Jordan 17 it's dead stock, never worn uh, shoe with the box and the suit and the suitcase. So it's a it's very simple, right? All black upper leather is awesome. I mean, look how old this is, and this leather is amazing. Man, the, the stuff they used back in the day was awesome. Then it comes with a shroud right here, and I'm gonna have a B, I'm gonna have B roll up. But in this shroud, let me get this one because I'm scared to break it. It's so delicate now. On the shroud right here, it has the number 10 and 11 in the inside. I'm guessing that's that this fits size 10, 10 and a half, or 11. That's my guess. But right here, it has music notes. Right there. See? See the music notes? That's more inspiration of the jazz theme we're talking about. The stock S tag, which I am going to use my knife now. Should have been done this. Bye bye, stock X tag. Thank you. So now that we got that out the way, by the way, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. It's fun doing these videos for you guys, it's fun doing it for myself. Be a part of the family, be a lounger. Also, on all my socials, scorchers underscore lounge is for all my socials. Please give me a nice little follow button right there so you can become a part of that as well. And also, you can message me. DM me. Is there a shoe you like to see that I that you don't know how you feel about? Maybe I have it. I have a lot of shoes here. Maybe I might have that shoe for you. Um, is there a shoe you want to compare or something to yours? Or do you have some shoes and you brought it from somebody, you know, and it was a little flaky and you want to see if it's legit or something? I don't know. Whatever it is. Hit my DMs up, ask me any questions, I'll respond in a nicely manner, and let's get it going. Alright, now that that's out the way again, so, look, the metal right here, it got it still got the peel off blue sign right there, and man, this shoe is like greasy. This plastic part right here, it's real sticky, and what I think happened is that the glue... I think it's glue guys to be honest I was trying to see if I had some wipes here I think what happened was the glue you know melted or whatever throughout those those years because it was here for a long time I mean when I got this shoe I got this shoe I mean you know I don't say I got this shoe in like 20 I don't know I don't say right here let me maybe I post it up if I find it I think I got it like 2018 or something so you're talking about four to five years in my room itself, especially where he had it locked up. And, you know, most likely it was just the glue that melted and then vaporized. And then being that this is plastic, it caught it more than the leather. That's my guess. But also, who cares? I can't wait to rock them. I know I'm going to turn mad heads because people are not going to know what the hell I got on my feet. All right. Let's see what's in here. Man, I... I never, except for when I got it. By the way, the Jordan 3 Iris is coming out in three minutes, but I already got a pair, so I'm not stripping. That's what that alarm was about. So, I'm going to... Oh, is this a crack? Nope, it's not a crack. Okay. So, I never opened this and examined it thoroughly well. I just wanted to make sure it was legit. So I compared it to the beater that I had because I told you I had the shoe. So I compared it to the shoe I had and it was perfect. And this is the first time I'm doing a real like review. Like everything plastic is real sticky, man. It comes with, it's supposed to be clear lace locks. I'm going to see if I can get all the sticky stuff off. But it got, it got like round. I don't know how to call these laces. These laces are flat, but they're like puffed up. They're, they're flat, but puffed up. You know so let me see why wow, I can't even press the button okay here it is Jeez, Louise fellas let's see what's inside the sneakers man 
All right. Uh, this come with tissue paper. I don't remember if it did or not, but I'm pretty sure it did. That was a lot of tissue paper back then in the days. Then it just come with your metallic silver Jordan sign right there inside. There's nothing else. I'm sorry, guys. I, you know I like taking out the uh, the insoles, but I'm so scared with this shoe to do anything. <laughs> so if I was to take this paper off, it's going to say Jordan right there. The same style that it says it on the heel. That was the signature Jordan 17 Jordan logo. And then this is how it looked like with a shroud on. Which, that's how it looked with the shroud on. And, you know, I just wanted this shoe for collection purposes, to be honest. Um, I don't even know how wearable they are. I'm definitely going to put that to the test. However, I need to wear these when I'm not far. You know what I mean? Like, I want to wear these, but then bring a pair of J's. Just in case if they break or they crumble, like, I could just wrap them up real quick and put my other sneakers on. Like, I ain't going to take this on vacation or anything like that or to a concert. But, like, definitely, I need to wear them just to wear them. Um, so, the bottom right here, it got a lot of different pods with herringbone traction, which is, like, the signature basketball traction you need instead of the whole shoe be hair and bone it's just, it's a lot of pods and different angles that mimic your foot so right here will be your big toe you know your small toe you got your palm of the foot whatever that's called you know what i'm saying so it kind of supports all the pressure points of the heel and hair and bone traction pods now i don't know what this is I don't know if there's a shank plate in there or not, but yeah, I remember that this shoe was comfortable, so I don't know about now. Let me look at this shoe, see if there's anything different. No, it got tissue paper as well inside, the same metallic sign, got your tag right there. Oh, you know what? They came out with this shoe in a double box set in 28 in, in 2008 so if i need a fucking if i need a donor if i need a donor bottom i could easily get it hopefully that holds up pretty well anyways just random thoughts but yeah this is your review of the jordan 17 metallic silver that's your review, guys. Until next time, peace out. Have a great day. Thanks for watching. Hey, loungers. I forgot to add this in. Y'all just saw the review of the Jordan 17. Let me let me show you just again. Y'all already saw the review of the Jordan 17. Black and chrome. Right? And I told you, I had them all. I had them all back then. Obviously, I wore them down, so the shoe is not here. But I want to collect them all again. So here goes the other cases. Here goes your other shoe cases of the other Jordan 17. So he came out with the black and silver for 200 bucks. Comes in this black and silver box. Oh my gosh. I'll fix that later. And they all the suitcases come in this same exact box with the label right there. So I still have all the suitcases right here. So I'm going to put this one down and make some room. This is the original that I just showed you. And it came out this case right here. It had the Wizards. I'm going to have the picture up in a second. It had the, the Jordan 17 Wizards colorway. This one came out first in... Uh, I believe it was January this one came out first however I don't have the shoe I don't have the shoes but I haven't opened this in like over five years or so and there's something in here I just don't know what it is so let's do it together and this one also has the Jordan sign right here and it's like it got a whole bunch of little dots on it let's see let's see what's in here I'm gonna let y'all see first Wait, no, I should do it this way, right? I'm going to let y'all see first. 
there's no paper. Okay. Oh wow, an old ass Air Jordan One. What is this? A cool gray Air Jordan One. Wow, 2014. An Air Jordan One mid from 2014, man. So that's what's in here. This is actually I gotta clean this up. I kind of like this shoe. Forgot all about it. I'm I'm pretty sure I put it because it got the gray. Oh wow, look at this one. Woo! You can tell I was at a club or something, bro. All right, so I'm pretty sure I put this here because. Oh look, I got the CD ROM. I got the CD. I got the CD ROM. I got the CD ROM. All right. I'm pretty sure I put that there because this is a gray shoe and it's a gray in a gray box. All right. Got to clean that up. All right. Get that one out the way. Oh wait, my bad. <laughs> and then this one came out second, which is exactly what I just showed you, right? However, this is is, is something in here. I just don't know what it is. So we're gonna find out together. Oh man, this is a little beat up. If y'all see that right there, it's a little beat up right there. Probably gonna have to do something about that. Let's see what's in here. Like I said, you find out first. Oh, there's paper. Oh! Oh, shit! Bro! Oh man, I gotta do a whole separate video for this. Man, this is all my Jordan stuff from like. Bro, Jordan do rag. What? See that? You ready? When you see this sign, you know this is 2010s and stuff. Early stuff. Oh man, this is. Oh, bro. Yeah, this video is already too long. I will definitely know. Oh man, this. Oh, this is crazy. I'll do a little separate video for this. Damn. Damn, I can't even close it, bro. I got, oh, all right, let's just get this out the way. And then this one came out last. This one, so this one was January and then February. This one came like two months apart, right? The black with the black chrome with the wizards, they came out like two months right after each other, all for 200. Then he took a very long time, came out with the third and final one the third and final one that came with the suitcase and this is just an all flat red with the Jordan sign still it's flat red though it don't got the ripples like the black one and the silver one does oh I think this one's empty bro I think this one is empty let's see you guys first yeah this one's empty what is this the receipt yeah, this one's empty, guys. I got the lace locks. <laughs> Piss yellow lace locks. Man, what the hell is this? Oh, arch supports? I don't even... Yeah, like... No sneakers in here. But, uh, just wanted to show y'all the suitcase... All the suitcase, uh... The suitcases that come with this stuff. You know what I'm saying? As I put this together, guys... Don't forget to like comment subscribe again I recorded I mean I repeated that again I'm gonna repeat it again let me get a nice shot of all of them up here let me put this one right here I'm gonna put this one on top of this one yeah and there you have it there you have it. and guess what I got more cases there's a lot more shoes that came out with cases, fellas, but I'll get to that on a different day. This is just the OG 17 cases right here. I hope this become a thumbnail. <laughs> All right, guys, to later. Peace out.